Hey guys, it's Paul. I want to show you how you can quickly add a cookie consent code to your uh, WordPress blog or website so that you're complying with EU law. Obviously, the GDPR is coming out too soon. So I was looking into it and I just wanted to make sure I was compliant. So the first thing you need is a privacy page. I don't have one. So what I've got is uh, a privacy document that I've edited that suits my website. I'll share this document. Well, in fact, I'll show you where to go to to get this document and you can copy and paste it and edit it the best for your website. Now, you may want to go and get legal advice. You may want to talk to your um, talk to your lawyer, but this is how I'm doing it. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this. I'm going to add a new page. I'm going to call it privacy policy. And I'm just going to paste it in. Oh, put it visual here. When you paste, you want to put in, don't put it as text, put it as visual. And paste that in, right? Publish that page. So that obviously will be appymegolf.com forward slash privacy policy. So when I view the page, now it's got your privacy is very important. And, you know, it doesn't look fantastic here I, I may go back and edit it so it looks a little bit better but that's now my privacy policy i want to put that down the bottom in the footer so i'm going to copy the link uh, in fact you won't need to because on menus it'll be a pick go to menus and then i've got a oh that's the top and the bottom one isn't it so i'm going to untick this menu for um the footer so obviously in your in your theme it may be different. It might not be you might not have options for header, footer. You have to decide where you're putting it. You might have to put it in a widget in the footer. Um, in fact, yeah. So I'm gonna put footer here. Create menu. And I'm gonna put Did I click it? Uh footer. I must have clicked it twice. So the footer menu, I'm going to drop in the privacy policy. Uh, I'm going to leave it as just that. I'll put latest post, right, just so you can see where it is. And click footer menu. Again, you may not have that on your theme. You may need to go to, to widgets and add it to the footer in your widgets. You may not even want to put the privacy policy in your footer. You don't have to. So at the bottom of the page now, I've got a little link that says privacy policy. So how to get a banner. I'm going to go to this site, uh, silktide, silktide.com, tools, cookie, consent. Um, the download, I think I've already done it, right? I'll put a link to it. It is download. So there. I'll put a link to this to get to it. But what you're going to do is decide on the theme as to where you want your banner. And probably because I've got this little help button in the bottom corner and... This widget would be, that one's probably going to be all right across it. I may use that. This one wouldn't be because the got it is, is behind the help. That one's not bad. And as a header one. So these are dark ones and these are light ones, right? So I'm going to, where am I going to put it? I'm going to put it in the box popping up uh, over this help, right? So I'm going to use, my website's light, light colored. So I'm going to use the dark one. Continue, customize, cook, uh, privacy policy, copy, paste. If you want to change the wording where it says this website uses cookies to ensure you get best experience, you can customize that by ticking that and changing. Copy the code. Oh, continue. Copy the code. So I'm going to copy this. And then you're going to look wherever you put your like Google Analytics code or where you put your code for a help box, you want to go to that and edit it. So again, in themes, they'll be different. But in my theme, it says here, custom code, and then the header. So when I go paste that in there, so it'll generally be near your analytics, near your, uh, the other, actually the cookies that you've put on your website. Save it. When you visit the site for the first time, oh, should now get a box. 
there's the box just about out the way of the help uh, website and then got it I should have clicked on the link should I? so let's go here happy me golf should bring up the box there's the box so where it says more info that'll obviously take me to my privacy policy if you want to check if you want to copy that uh, privacy policy obviously you want to go through and um, delete anything there that's not relevant to you edit it change the happy me the happy me limited stuff uh, and you're welcome to take it but that's how to quickly add without having to add plugins or anything funky to your site that may slow it down just a little cookie consent uh, pop-up hope it helps cheers guys